Good evening, my friend, and welcome to your guided sleep story. My name is Stephen Dalton, and it's my privilege to be the voice that you listen to as you go to sleep tonight. After the story, the sounds of the Serengeti will continue to play so they can accompany you a little longer while you sleep. If you haven't already, I'd really appreciate if you could subscribe to my channel and give the video a thumbs up. So just make yourself comfortable in your bed. Adjust your pillow and tuck yourself in. Now close your eyes whenever you feel ready. Place your arms and legs in a position that is comfortable for you, where you can relax completely. Your feet are relaxed and loosened. Your back and head also find a position that is comfortable for you. Now, feel your breath. Notice how your chest rises and falls. In and out. Relaxation comes all by itself. Notice the sounds around you, if there are any. Notice how they come and go, and you have no control over the sounds that you hear, including the sound of my voice. Sounds help us to relax more and more, and the sound of my voice Allow it to relax you deeper and deeper. Now I'm going to count down from ten to one. And as I do, allow yourself to let go more and more. Sink a little deeper into your bed as I go from ten down to nine. Let go more and more. Nine, you feel a deep calm and serenity. Eight, a comforting and relaxed feeling spreads. Seven, deep harmony fills you. Six, great silence strikes you. Five, sink further and further. Four, let go of everything around you, everything. Three, let everything flow 
relaxation flowing through your body. Two, you are released and free. One, go deep now, deep into your world of fantasy. Let your imagination flow as I take you on your sleep story. Tonight, you find yourself in one of the most exceptional places on planet Earth, the Serengeti in Africa. As you sit in the back of the spacious Jeep, you take in the breathtaking sights of the Serengeti. The dust from the dirt road gently floats in the air, creating a dream-like atmosphere. You feel so comfortable and relaxed in this Jeep, and your safari hat keeps you cool under the morning sun. The jeep stops, and you look through your binoculars, scanning the horizon. Then, in the distance, you see something moving. You look even closer and realize your first animal that you have seen this morning is a magnificent elephant. You marvel at this sight and take a deep breath, feeling a wonderful sense of peace wash over you. Now the Serengeti is a world of its own. Far from the hustle and bustle of the city. Here there are no tall buildings or paved roads. Just the vast expanse of nature. Perhaps you feel privileged to witness this wildlife in its natural habitat, free, free and unencumbered. You read your guidebook for a moment, and it talks about the importance of preserving these beautiful lands for generations to come. You close your eyes, taking in the sounds of the wildlife and the gentle rumble of the jeep as it begins to move again. You feel completely at ease. The Serengeti National Park really is a sanctuary for the animals that call it home. And you feel a sense of calm, knowing that they are protected here and their natural beauty is preserved. As the Jeep moves deeper and deeper, into the park. You catch a glimpse of something else in the distance. You take up your binoculars again. This time, it's a majestic lioness 
lounging in the shade of a tree. Perhaps you feel a deep sense of gratitude for being able to witness such a sight. This really is a rare privilege. The morning air in the Serengeti is very refreshing, and the cool breeze that sweeps through the jeep is invigorating. The dry terrain and the green shrubs create a beautiful contrast that is indeed a feast for the eyes. You go to take out your camera to capture the moment, but then you stop yourself, and just in this moment, you decide to be fully present with what you see. You take some deep breaths and you remind yourself that this is a moment that will stay with you forever. You close your eyes and you feel the gentle sway of the jeep and notice the hypnotic sound of the tires rolling across the dirt road. You feel content and serene. The Serengeti is a place of wonder and beauty. And as you move slowly across the park, you feel yourself getting lost in the vastness of the landscape. The morning sun is still low in the sky and casts amazing long shadows across the terrain. You take a deep breath and feel the warmth of the sun on your face and the cool breeze on your skin. You smile, feeling grateful for this incredible journey and the memories that you will carry forever. The tour guide's keen eye spots something ahead, and so he brings the jeep to a stop. He motions for you to look to your right, where a pride of lions is starting their day. You excitedly reach for your binoculars and catch a glimpse of a female lion staring back at you. Next to her, a great big male lounges lazily in the tall grass. They're hard to spot at first, because they blend in with the grass around them. But they become clearer as they begin to stroll along. As the lions get closer, 
You notice a couple of younger lions with them. The little spots on their sandy fur give them away as cubs. And you feel your heart flutter with excitement. You watch in awe as these beautiful creatures walk through the land with the cubs poking their heads above the grass to see what's happening. This time, you can't help but take a couple of photos, and then your guide tells you a little more about lions. You hear that a pride is made up of lions that are related to one another. And the females rear their cubs together. The complexity of their social structure is fascinating. And you feel somehow welcome and safe here and very grateful for the opportunity to witness these wonderful creatures firsthand. As the sun rises higher in the sky, the tour continues, and you're eager to see what other incredible creatures you'll come across this morning. The dust from the dirt road fills the air, and you feel the gentle sway of the jeep as it moves through the park. In the distance, you spot the unmistakable stripes of a herd of zebras. You're amazed at their beauty, with their perfectly symmetrical black and white stripes. You're not sure if it's black and white or white and black, but you're captivated nonetheless and you can't wait to get a closer look. As the jeep stops, and you look at the zebras, you're struck by the intricate patterns on their coats, and how gracefully they move almost synchronized together. You're mesmerized by their beauty, and you feel a sense of peace wash over you. As your tour continues, Perhaps you're filled with a sense of awe and wonder at these incredible creatures that call the Serengeti home. Perhaps you feel humbled by them and the fragility of their world. As you watch the zebras graze on the tall grass, you're fascinated to learn from your guide that the stripes on their coats serve two purposes. They help the zebras blend in with their surroundings, making it difficult for predators to spot them, but they also help prevent pests, like little flies or other pests from bothering them. 
You're amazed at the ingenuity of nature and feel further calmed by the beauty here. These zebras are so close. You don't need your binoculars this time. They curiously approach the jeep. And after determining that you're friendly, they all cross the dirt road in front of you, migrating to a different patch of tall grasses. They move so gracefully, their stripes shimmering in the sunlight. Perhaps you feel a sense of peace, knowing that these creatures are thriving in their natural habitat. You move further along, and soon you are greeted once again by the African elephant. This time there are a few. They are way in the distance, so you feel very safe. And perhaps you feel a sense of wonder at their sheer size, their big, powerful strides seem effortless, and their long trunks swing softly between their ivory tusks, their massive ears flap in the breeze, which act as fans to cool them off. You're in awe of their majesty and feel a deep sense of respect for these gentle giants. There are two elephant calves playing together. And perhaps you smile as the two calves cheerfully run around their mothers like they're playing tag. How joyful it is to watch their innocence and exuberance Perhaps you're reminded of the importance of protecting these beautiful lands so that future humans can experience the same sense of wonder that you are feeling now. And so these animals will always live in their beautiful part of the world. Your guide tells you that African elephants are the largest land mammals. They can stand anywhere between 8 and 13 feet and can live for up to 70 years. They play a vital role in their community. They dig up rivers with their tusks, which create water holes during the dry season. They also shape the terrain, which makes it easier for grazing animals like zebras 
to move throughout the landscape. Perhaps you're reminded of the importance of community and how in this natural world everything is so interconnected. As you watch the elephants, a sense of tranquility washes over you. The world seems to slow down, and you're able to fully appreciate the majesty of these magnificent creatures. It's early evening now, and you take a deep breath, feeling the warm African sun on your skin, and you allow yourself to be fully present in this moment. You travel further in your adventure. You see ostriches racing through the grass, which fills you with a sense of childlike joy. Perhaps you're reminded that life is not always serious and that it's important to let go and have fun. You feel a sense of freedom and lightness, as if you're letting go of everything. As you drive towards your camp, you see hippos bathing in the water. And all manner of birds and other animals flocking around this life-giving source. The jeep continues on the dusty road. And as you get nearer and nearer to your camp, your eyes become heavier and heavier. The gentle sway of the vehicle lulls you into a peaceful state. The sounds of the nature add to the tranquility of the moment. The warm African sun, which felt so invigorating earlier, is now disappearing behind the horizon. And our nearest star feels soothing and comforting as it says goodbye to the day. The moon soon takes its place as you arrive in your camp and your guide serves you a delicious meal while you sit around a campfire and listen to him tell you amazing stories folk legends about his people surviving in this amazing land for thousands and thousands of years.
soon you feel very tired and you retire to your beautiful bell tent that has been prepared for you. You close the door and inside you are completely shut off from everything outside. You feel so safe and you lie into your luxurious double bed with rich cotton sheets and you are comforted further by the nighttime sounds and the campfire outside. You feel gratitude for the day you have experienced and you go to sleep with a great sense of peace deep within your heart. Good night, my friend. Sleep well.